Faced with the daily circumstances, our bodies are subjected to large amounts of stress. And if left untreated after long periods of time, stress can affect nearly every system of our body. The cardiovascular system, the immune system, the musculoskeletal system, and even the endocrine system and our hormones. So today in this video, I'm going to talk about how stress can show up on your tongue. And we have a volunteer patient. And if we could please take a look at your tongue. Similar to the eyes being a window to one's soul, a tongue is also a valuable tool for practitioners of traditional Chinese medicine for determining diagnosis as well as the treatment plan. From the tongue, we can tell about your overall constitution, whether you're on the hotter side or colder side, how well your body is absorbing the nutrients, about your digestive state, and about your emotional state. So how does the normal tongue look like? The normal tongue is usually pink, has a thin white coating, and looks neither thin nor swollen. It should not quiver or deviate to one side. Here is a map of the tongue. At the tip, we have the heart and the lung organs. The sides reflect the state of the liver and the gallbladder. Digestive system is in the middle, and the back corresponds to the kidneys and the bladder. Organs that most commonly get affected by stress are our heart and our liver and gallbladder. With this patient's tongue, we can see that the heart area, the tip, is quite red possibly due to prolonged stress. And also the sides of the tongue that correspond to the liver and gallbladder have a purplish hue, indicating a stagnating energy in those areas. As you can see, stress can take a heavy toll on the body. During stressful periods, it's especially important to take time for yourself. Relax, get enough sleep, exercise, eat healthy, and also get regular acupuncture treatments to balance your energy flow.